Hey, Herr Krishna, what's good with it? We sure hope all is well, and we sure appreciate you taking the time to check out what we have going on. This lesson is about the concept of a Ford maker, and how its ancient importance still holds true today. So stay a while and check out the lesson and see if it's vibes with your soul. Again, thank you for stopping by, and after the lesson is over, be sure to check out the rest of the site. We may have some things that might pique your interest. The Sacred Ford, a lesson on self-realization. Imagine you're on a quest, a journey to find your true self. But there's a river in your way, a river of challenges and obstacles. It's like, nope, not gonna let you cross. Genesis 31, 21. But don't worry, ancient wisdom has got your back. The river is a symbol for any challenge you face in life. It's there to test your courage and make you stronger. Bhagavad Gita 1858. The scriptures show the way. By following the path of righteousness, Matthew 5, 44, John 14, 6, Luke 12, 33, Romans 12, poem 1, you can dissolve your ego and make room for compassion. 1 Corinthians 13. You can conquer your inner foes by maintaining peaceful stillness amid life's turbulence. James 1, 2, 4. And here's the cool part. When you help others without expecting anything in return, Matthew 25, 35, 40. You're not only making the world a better place, you're also liberating yourself, Galatians 5.1. Renouncing the fruits of your actions cuts the roots of attachment, Bhagavad Gita 2.47.49. Freeing your soul to soar untethered. Remember, these are universal currents flowing throughout existence itself, Ephesians 4.6. In the cosmic realm, Even the greatest master's new struggle, their triumph reveals humanity's sacred potential. Hebrews 11. By identifying with your immortal spirit over your mortal form, 2 Corinthians 5.17, you can achieve perpetual victory, 1 John 5.4. And what is education, if not this movement beyond all limitation? Proverbs 1.7. I invite you to reflect on how aligning each step of your life's journey with the eternal verities of harmlessness, compassion, and selfless service inspires unmatched strength, wisdom, and bliss. John 15, 11. The Ford awaits you, dear ones. I have faith in your soul's greatness. Will you now have faith in yourselves? Our true nature calls us ever onwards to help, uplift, and be uplifted by all. Romans 12, 15. The future is ours to script with love, 1 Corinthians 13.13. 13. Moral of the story, the journey of self-realization is not always easy, but it is always worth it. By following the path of righteousness, compassion, and service, you can overcome any obstacle and achieve your full potential. So, have faith in yourself and cross the sacred ford. May the ancient wisdom traditions, from the Agamas to the Avesta, guide you on your journey. And for a secret sauce pro tip, do Krishna Mudras when you are meditating. It will help you attain your spiritual and physical realm goals faster. Hare Krishna.